Hello, everyone. Welcome to Clarity RX's very first uh, monthly webinar series. So we are going to start conducting a monthly webinar, different topics. And our very first topic today is going to be a mask for every occasion. So if everyone can just go on mute. Perfect. Thank you guys so much. Um, thank you, first and foremost, for taking the time to, to tune in with me. Um, masks have been a very, very popular request, and, and I think throughout COVID, they have become so popular, and it was interesting as spas are starting to open up. Curious to see that if masks were still going to stay around, and they, marry, they very much have, and they're only growing. So again, just to introduce myself, I'm Danielle Rasil. I am a licensed esthetician, um, and I am very excited to dive into Clarity RX's mask um, treatment options that are available for you guys. So within our um, protocol, we have three different, I'm sorry, we have six different steps to creating a healthy skin regimen. So within all of our products, as you guys all know, we are free of synthetic dyes, synthetic fragrances, we are paraben free, we are filler free. And you will notice as we're going through each and every one of the masks, they all have a unique color to it and a unique aroma. So as you're talking about masks to your clients, I think that it's a very important uh, point to make and just remind them that these vibrant, beautiful colors that the masks have are due to the ingredients themselves and not because Clarity says, you know, I want this mask to be pink because it's going to look pretty on the shelf or in the bathroom counter, but because of those active ingredients is giving that product that color. So the more that we can remind our, our clients, the better off. So Within our six step regimen, so we have your cleanse and exfoliate, then we have correct. Within the clarity line, it is broken down into two different types of correctives. So you have your acid based correctives, and then you have your serum based correctives. Then we have your hydrator. So think adding water um, into the skin. Then we have lubricate. So this is going to be more of your emollient, your lipids, help to repair that barrier function. Then the most important step, so I don't really talk about it in our Mask for Every Occasion webinar, but it would be a miss on my part if I didn't remind everybody um, of how important an SPF is on a daily basis especially when you are incorporating masks that may to it may help to increase that cell turnover um, within the skin. So we want to make sure that we are protecting the skin. We do have two different options now. So the skin defense with the newly reformulated, much more cosmetically elegant, smooth, rich texture. And then we have our purely physical sunscreen, which is going to be the physical tinted SPF 50. And then last but not least, within our six-step treatment regimen, we have our mask step. And that is going to be what we're going to talk about today is masking. So I found this um, while pulling together some different information here. I, I found this quote that really stood out. And, and I think it highlight what stood out most to me is the fact that it is a board certified dermatologist that is speaking to it. And it was a great definition um, and just a nice overview of masks themselves. So face masks can be an effective way to deliver an intensive burst of nourishing and therapeutic skincare ingredients in a highly concentrated form. So a lot of times within masks and going through a, a daily care regimen, this tends to be one of the last steps that are added into your client's skincare regimen. First, we're starting off, you know, with your cleansers, then we have your moisturizers, then we're going to introduce some corrective serums, then we think about masks. And, and what I want to um, have each of you guys walk away with today is a better understanding of our Clarity RX's mask options, 
how to use them not only in the treatment room, but recommending them for your clients at home, but also walk away with ways that you can customize the mask treatment for your clients when they go home with them. Because this is truly a powerful, concentrated treatment option to help take your client's results to that next level. So within our line, we have seven different options to choose from. And I'm gonna go through each and every one of these um, masks by themselves. And then we'll finish the, the webinar with uh, sharing some tips and tricks from the professionals. So different customization opportunities. So one thing I wanna stress when we do dive into the customizing approach, this will be for at home use only. In the treatment room, you have access to each and every one of these seven results-driven masks. Just important that you are following along with the Clarity RX protocols within the treatment room. Then when the client goes home, you have the opportunity to recommend that they start using these products on a weekly basis. And there will be different ways that you can help to tailor towards their specific concern and results that you're working with them on based off of the mask and different ways of other kind of combining with other uh, retail products. So without further ado, I'm going to dive into our very first mask, and this is going to be our cold compress. So cold compress is a very soothing and cooling mask. So kind of how the name leads you and directs you, the cold compress, it's going to calm and soothe any sort of redness and, and inflammation in the skin. Now it does have aloe vera leaf juice in it, which is rich in antioxidants. It has cucumber extract. So cucumber extract not only helps to soothe the skin, but it is going to increase any sort of hydration within the skin. And it actually helps to aid in wound healing. And same with aloe vera leaf juice. So um, I know almost like an old wives thing of tip and trick. If you get a sunburn, especially when we're coming out of those summer months, if you get a sunburn, aloe vera um, is really, really potent and calming and soothing that inflammation within the skin. So thinking about that aloe vera leaf juice and, and its properties and how it's going to target any sort of stress inflamed skin. Now, we slot this product for all skin types. As we know, the skin can just depending on different uh, lifestyle, maybe you do spend a little bit more time outside, the skin can become um, stressed. And so anytime that the skin becomes stressed or inflamed and just needs a little extra TLC, reaching for cold compress is a phenomenal solution. Now, one kind of pro tip with this product, you don't have to keep it in the refrigerator to have that cooling effect and cooling sensation. But if you want to take that cooling sensation up a notch, have your client store the cold compress in their refrigerator at home. Another little way to, to use this at home for your clients if they happen to wake up and maybe have more like puffy and inflamed eyes, they don't have to necessarily apply the cold compress mask full face. So you can almost use this as a targeted treatment for underneath the eyes. So keep it in the refrigerator, apply a small amount underneath the eyes, let it sit in there for about 10 minutes, and you will watch to see how much it actually pulls out any sort of like puffiness, inflammation within the eye area. So another ingredient that's in here that we don't have like highlighted on the screen here, but I did want to touch on is pineapple. So pineapple is rich with antioxidants and it's going to not only brighten the skin, but what a lot of people don't know is that pineapple will help to reduce any sort of inflammation. So it's not in this product in a high concentration to where you're worried about that exfoliation um, mechanism of action. It is utilized in this product for its calming and anti-inflammatory properties in there. It also has yarrow flowers, which is again, very calming and rich in antioxidants. All right, so then our next mask that we're going to talk about is going to be our rehab mask. 
So rehab is going to be our Mediterranean detoxifying mud mask. So the main purpose and, and target uh, for rehab is to help to detoxify the skin and pull out any sort of toxin, toxins and impurities. So we have this kind of recommended for use for your oily, problematic, or congested skin. This is the skin types or, or condition that can use this on a more regular basis. Now, if you have somebody, I know we get questions, you know, what, what if I have a client who has more of the, the drier skin, but they're very, very congested in the T-zone? Would this still be an appropriate treatment option to recommend for them to use at home? And the answer is absolutely. So this is a mask that, again, similar to the cold compress where you can target treat the skin, you can use the clear or the rehab mask to be able to target that T-zone area or that area that experiences more congestion. You'll have some of those clients that maybe just their forehead tends to be more congested and more problematic absolutely be a great treatment option is send your client home with the rehab mask and just instruct them to apply it to only the area that is needed. So in this case, if it's the T-zone or the forehead, they'll be able to see a huge improvement within their skin. So the ingredients in here, we actually have five different detoxifying clays and muds. So these clays are designed to sit on the, on the surface of the skin and they almost act like a, a magnet. So they're drawing out any of those toxins or impurities that are clogging the pores. Now what this will do, this will actually decrease the appearance of your pores. And the way that it's doing that is if you have a pore that is constantly impacted with dirt, debris, and sebum, it will actually start to begin over time, stretch out that pore. And when it is impacted full of dirt, debris, and sebum, and it may have more of a gray appearance or turn into a blackhead, you're going to see that pore more visibly. So with rehab, way it's detoxifying and removing those impurities, it's also in turn going to reduce the appearance of those larger pores. Another ingredient that I wanted to highlight in the rehab mask is going to be burdock root. So burdock root is known for its antibacterial and antifungal properties. It is also great at helping to normalize or regulate that sebum production. So for that shiny T-zone area or for your clients that have excessive sebum production, by utilizing this on a regular basis, so for instructions of use, we have it two to three times per week, apply it to the clean skin, leave on for 10 to 15 minutes and remove, this will over time actually help to regulate that excessive sebum production within the skin. It's also highly effective in relieving um, any sort of inflammation. So when you have more acne prone, um, congested skin, a lot of times you'll see more inflammation within the skin. And this burdock root will help to calm the inflammation in there. So again, this would be nighttime use, full face application, but don't be afraid and don't shy away from spot treating or recommending your clients to spot treat when they are using it at home. The next mask we have is our daily fruit antioxidant moisturizing mango mask. So this has a wonderful experience in, involved in this. And I know in, in the treatment room, a lot of you, um, you have your clients just say, oh my gosh, I love the way that the daily fruit mask smells. And, it, and it's a nice experience for you as well when performing the treatment. So not only does it kind of calm and soothe just your client in general because of that um, experience that they have with the aroma of the mask, that, ex that aroma is being caused from the mango butter. So mango butter is very, very nourishing to the skin. So it's going to help to strengthen and firm and be able to protect and rebuild the elasticity and suppleness within the skin. So it's going to result in smoother, firmer, brighter complexion. There is a peptide in here. So you'll notice that there's palmitoyl tetrapeptide 7. 
So this is a great peptide because not only is it helping to improve the elasticity, this is also a peptide that will um, protect the skin and it will aid in hydration as well. So some studies have another benefit within the palmitoyl tetrapeptide 7, or there are some studies that have shown that this peptide in particular can act as a UV filter. So yes, antioxidants are great for neutralizing and balancing out those free radicals, but this peptide specifically has been shown to help to act as a UV filter. So we still slot this mask like all of our other masks for nighttime use only. But if you have that client, a lot of times we wanna make sure that we're customizing the treatment regimen. Maybe they have more time in the morning to do their mask treatments. They are perfectly okay and it's safe to use this um, daily fruit antioxidant moisturizing mango mask in the morning as well and you have that additional added antioxidant free radical fighting benefits in there. Another ingredient that's going to protect the skin is going to be your sea buckhorn berry oil. Um, not only is this protecting the skin, it also or includes constituents such as vitamin C, vitamin E, um, carotenoids, and amino acids. So this in particular, this ingredient in particular is a shrub that's native to Europe and Asia. And it also has a, uh, it's all about protection. So when you think of your daily fruit mask and who can benefit most um, with this mask, yes, you can use it for all skin types and all skin conditions with that antioxidant activity. But when you're really targeting to who's going to benefit most from it, think of your dry, your mature, and your sun damaged skin. Next up is our rise and shine. So this is our lifting collagen mask. So our names are, are very um, fun and a little bit different, but they do kind of lead you down the right path of who this would be good for or what the overall benefits of the mask will be. So with Rise and Shine, it is a lifting collagen mask. So the collagen that's in here is actually solu soluble marine collagen. So soluble marine collagen actually acts as a filler. So it's going to help to rebuild that dermal density in there, um, and it's going to reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. The other cool thing about the marine collagen is it's going to help to boost that microcirculation within the skin. When you have that microcirculation, because it's on a, on a deeper level, you're not going to have that flushing that occurs, um, but it's going to keep that blood flow moving. Now, thinking of repairing um, and restorative action within the skin, blood flow, oxygen, and all the vital, vital nutrients that our blood contains is imperative. And so by increasing that microcirculation, you're helping to improve the overall health of the skin and actually aiding in um, wound healing response. This also has the capability to help bind water to the skin. So this mask, you'll use it in the treatment room. Um, it's oftentimes paired with a lot of our LED um, upgrade services because it's beneficial for all skin types and all skin conditions. Um, but with it helping to bind that water into the skin, it's going to soften the skin. It's gonna help to reduce that transepidermal water loss in conjunction with the hydrolyzed silk proteins that are within this formulation. So those hydrolyzed silk proteins provide that moisture as well as the capability to reduce that trans epidermal water loss. And overall, it will help to enhance the skin's lipid barrier function. So this is a mask that we do recommend that you use it at night. You can use it two to three times um, per week apply a thick amount at home and you'll leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes. 
We slot this one for nighttime a couple different reasons, but as our skin is in repair mode while we sleep, it's best to have these ingredients that are going to help to repair and rebuild that collagen, restore that elasticity in the skin when it's on, um, when it's going through that repair mode. All right, next up, we have our Return to Calm CBD mask. So this is um, our newest mask um, in our Clarity line. This is another mask that is recommended for all skin types and skin conditions. This is the mask utilized in the Return to Calm CBD facial. So as its name tells you, its main goal and purpose of this mask specifically is help to reduce any sort of inflammation within the skin and promote any sort of healing in the skin. So you'll notice that there is a uh, cannabidiol in there as well as cannabis sativa seed oil. So that cannabis sativa seed oil is rich in omega fatty acids, um, vitamin E and protein. So it has a very, very powerful anti-inflammatory property. So this is helping to manage or regulate the inflammatory response within our skin. We have our inflammatory response for a reason. It triggers our skin to go into repair mode. What happens though is if that inflammatory response never turns off, that's where the skin can become irritated and you'll be able to see that excessive inflammation. When you have excessive inflammation, that's when problems can occur within the skin. Now this cannabis sativa seed oil, not only is it rich and nutritious for the skin, it also aids as a delivery vehicle for the CBD ingredient itself. So in addition to the CBD in this mask, you have Pinus Pinister, which is a powerful antioxidant that will reduce redness and support healing. And you have ashwagandha, which is going to soothe the skin and support skin regeneration. Now the combination of CBD with the antioxidant Pinus Pinister and ashwagandha, the CBD actually helps to enhance the overall benefits of any other ingredient that is in the skin, so or within that formulation. So with the combination of the Pinus Pinister and ashwagandha paired with CBD, the CBD helps those two ingredients be able to reach its maximum potential and its maximum skin regeneration and antioxidant properties. So there really is no skin type or skin condition that cannot benefit from utilizing the Return to Calm CBD mask. A little bit goes a long way, so you don't need a lot. Um, this one you'll use just like all the others. You can use two to three times per week. Next up is our Live and Be Well Probiotic Pink Himalayan Salt Mask. So the probiotic in here is the lactobacillus probiotic. So this probiotic specifically will help to strengthen the skin's natural defense system. So our skin, one of its main goals is to protect. And if the skin's barrier function is not, not working or functioning the way that it should, it's not going to be able to protect ourselves from um, any sort of excessive environmental damage or stressors. It also has the capability to produce positive bacteria that will in turn produce antimicrobial peptides in there. And studies have shown that this specific probiotic is effective in reducing erythema as well as the ability to repair the skin's barrier function. The pink Himalayan salt serves as a, a natural detoxifier within the skin. So it's going to help the skin feel more refreshed and nourished. And then the horse kelp is renowned for its moisturizing properties. And the fun fact about horse kelp, um, horse tail kelp is that it actually helps to stimulate some collagen synthesis as well. All right, so I touched on this kind of throughout each um, mask, but up until now, just general application and usage. We saw our mask step at night. Um, so you'll apply a thick layer, um, leave on 10 to 15 minutes, remove with tepid water and follow with a moisturizer. 
Now, if you want to enhance that overall regimen even further, then you'll want to add those corrective serums. So you can add that after the mask has been removed and prior to the moisturizer. And you can use these masks two to three times per week. Last but certainly not least within our mask family is our sleep it off mask. So I could talk and go on and on about sleep it off mask, but one of the big things that I wanted to highlight um, during our time today with the sleep it off mask is just some um, key numbers in here. So sleep it off is a natural retinol alternative. So when we say that it's a natural retinol alternative, what we mean is that it has this similar smoothing effect like a retinol or like retinoids in general without the use of retinols and retinoids. We have seen within the studies that we've noticed the smoothing effect like retinols in the skin in as little as three weeks. So that is why we saw it. And when the instructions for use, we say 21 days of use. That is based off of the study and being able to see the overall improvements within the skin. So at 21 days, 95% of users within the study saw a significant improvement. Improvements include smoothing of the skin, softening of the texture of the skin, reduction in fine lines and wrinkles, um, and overall brightness and lumosity in the skin. And the blue-green algae is the retinol alternative ingredient that is within the Sleep It Off mask. In addition, you have your ginger and orange extracts, which are antioxidants that are going to aid in strengthening and rebuilding that collagen and elastin within the skin. Another fun fact that I wanted to share with you guys is that 63% of users within the 21 days noticed um, a decrease in the number of wrinkles and depth of wrinkles within the skin. So this is one mask that we definitely want to ensure that they are using at night um, because it is helping to increase that cell turnover. We want to make sure that the skin is protected. Now, it's not going to break down the way that a retinoid would in um, under sunlight, but because the skin is in repair mode, this mask is best used in the evening time. So you'll apply a liberal amount to clean skin every evening for 21 days. All right, finishing off our webinar today, wanted to some, I wanted to share some fun tips and tricks from the professional. Again, this is going to be for at-home use only. When we are utilizing these masks in the treatment room, it is imperative that you are following the hand and stone approved um, treatment protocol um, and not going off of that. But when you are recommending your clients to go home and use these masks, there are a lot of different things that you can do to help to tailor and customize the treatment for them in between them coming in to see you for their professional treatments. So rise and shine. Rise and Shine is probably our most versatile mask. So we can pick out here three different combinations and why you would use these combinations. So Rise and Shine can pair phenomenally with daily fruit. When you mix this, so you would do half and half, um, so split evenly the dosage of Rise and Shine and daily fruit. For those clients that you are wanting to have more of that antioxidant, um, increase the hydration within the skin, but overall firm and hydrate. So this is a fantastic combination for aging skin. Then you have Rise and Shine with cold compress. So Rise and Shine has a lot of added healing properties to it, help to strengthen the skin. Cold compress is very soothing and calming to the skin. So between the two of them, you're gonna get soothing and tightening. This is a great combination for your combination skin. Last combo here with Rise and Shine is Live and Be Well. So this is going to be great for detoxifying 
and those suffering um, from mask acne or adult acne. So you'll have those clients that are, you know, I want to help to treat those fine lines and wrinkles, but I'm also breaking out or I'm noticing some masking in here. What can I do? You can mix equal parts of rise and shine and live and be well at home for a wonderful customized treatment for them for their skin type. Next option here is to add in some, whether it's a serum or a lubricator within a mask. So here I've highlighted the Daily Fruit Antioxidant Moisturizing Mask, but you could add either one of these options um, to Rise and Shine. You could add it to the CBD Return to Calm Mask. Um, so to really tailor your mask, and we'll, we'll focus on the Daily Fruit here, you have somebody coming in who is more in that really dry, mature skin, and you want to add those extra lipids within their treatment. Uh, have them apply two to three drops. If they're really, really dry, maybe they need three to four drops of nourish your skin in with the mask. So you'll put two to three drops in the mask, whip that up and have them then apply daily fruit mask leave it on 10 to 15 minutes, that's going to add more lipids into their skin and into their regimen. Then if you have somebody who's more on the dehydrated um, case, adding daily dose of water is going to add that hydration, that water content into the skin. So again, put one to two drops of daily dose of water into the daily fruit mask, mix it together and apply it all at once. Next, we have our skin brightening. So rise and shine mixed with let there be light. Apply, do one to two pumps of let there be light into the rise and shine mask, mix it up. And now you have an enhanced skin brightening treatment mask. So your let there be light has uh, Rumex in there. It has alpha arbutin to help to suppress that melanocyte activity and break up any sort of um, hyperpigmentation within the skin, then you have it in combination with your rise and shine uh, mask that's going to be, again, your, your healing, your soothing, I'm sorry, your um, anti-aging, firming and strengthening mask. So aging also concerned with discoloration, pair these two together. Next, we have your return to calm CBD mask. So if somebody is very, very sensitive, um, add a drop or two of the take it easy. Now you're going to have that added increase anti-inflammatory properties from take it easy, anti-redness, as well as the powerful anti-inflammatory ingredient or properties of the CBD mask themselves dehydrated skin and you want to use CBD because they're still really inflamed um, and you really want to calm that inflammation, add a couple drops of daily dose of water in with your return to calm mask. Next, we have more of your acne clients. So you can actually use um, add a quarter of a teaspoon of fix it into the rehab mask. So a reminder, our fix it is going to be 2% salicylic acid. So put a little bit of the fix it in with your rehab mask, mix it together and apply it. So this is going to be slotted more for your resilient skin types and your um, oily skin. So rehab is definitely a versatile mask, um, but if you are going to combine the fix it in with rehab, ensure that you are slotting it for your oily resilient skin type to give it that added 2% boost in with the detoxifying mud and clip. Another option to spot treat um, overnight. So you can apply clears it to really zap those, um, those blemishes and those breakouts then apply the rehab over it, sleep with it overnight to really help to draw out that um, those dirt debris help to target the bacteria and those breakouts. So that would be a phenomenal spot treatment and targeted approach of being able to combine clears it and spot treat with the rehab uh, Mediterranean detoxifying mud mask over on top of it. All right, so just a reminder, we have um, a few 
I guess two weeks left, 10 days left of in the month of September. And Clarity RX, we are focusing all about masks. So the September promotion focusing towards kind of targeting your clients for every purchase of a mask, they will go home, your clients will go home with a travel size of daily dose of water. Now, daily dose of water can be combined with any one of our masks for added skin hydration benefits too. They can either put the daily dose of water in the mask itself, whip it up and apply, or they can apply um, the daily dose of water immediately after um, removing the mask to be able to increase that overall hydration within the skin. So this is going for the entire month of September. So we have about 10 days left to um, take advantage of this promotion. And one key thing I wanted to highlight here is the overall value to the client. So Travel size of daily dose of water is a $45 value. So this is a significant savings for your client and a great way to really help partner with your clients and target and customize your treatment approach based off of the mass that you are recommending, but then how you're going to instruct them to utilize daily dose of water to enhance their overall benefits and results with these mass purchases. So every purchase of a Clarity RX mask your clients will go home with a $45 value travel size daily dose of water. I hope this helps. I know we are just scratching the surface of all the wonderful options and, and opportunities to customize um, the treatment approach with our masks um, that Clarity RX has to offer. If you have any questions at all, please do not hesitate to ask. We are here to help. Thank you all for, for joining. It looks like we have one question here. Um, so I wanted to answer this before letting you guys go. If there's any other questions, please type them in the chat box and I will get them answered for you. Changing of colors. So questions on, on our shelf life, changing of colors. So we do not have um, any, we don't have shelf lives on, on our products specifically. Now there will be, um, with the exception of anything that has sunscreen in it. So skin defense, physical skin defense, um, or pucker power that has a two-year shelf life. Everything else, um, there will be and there can be a variation in color because they are all natural ingredients. Now, general rule of thumb, we say products are best used um, within three years. So all of these products on average, they should last about, you know, if you're using them twice a week and, and just directing them for appropriate portion size, I would say about um, four months on, on average is, is good. Um, a little bit goes a long way. So instructions and educating your clients how to use it is most important. So they shouldn't be running into, I guess, long-winded answer of they shouldn't be running into any issues with that expiration. But to have them, you know, hopefully calm, calm you guys and there will be a variation within the color just because of the nature of the natural ingredients. Yes, this is recorded and we will be sharing it so you guys can review them um, and go back through. All right, any other questions? All right, thank you guys so much. We, Jacqueline will go ahead and, and be sharing this in the newsletter. And then I will also be posting the link into, um, along with the PDF version of the PowerPoint into the Facebook page for the estheticians.